Hi folks, this is a bit different to our usual tutorial in the fact it's a lot more caricature. Um, I've really exaggerated things quite a lot, even the body I've exaggerated and made it a bit contorted and weird. It's Harley Quinn from the Suicide Squad films. Um, you may need to pause here and there. I struggled, so I had to really concentrate as I was doing it. So if you need to pause, please do and see how you get on. Okay, I'm going to start with a little line going across and then another small one going round and then I'm going to do some big eyes going to, one going across like that and one going across like that and then curve underneath going over and the same again on that side and then put some big eyelashes on there And then darken those eyes in. Just to thicken them up a little bit. Then we're going to do a little dot for an eye, and a little dot there, and then do a tiny little mark, and then an eyebrow going up, and the same again there, and and then put a line going across to the eye there, line to the eye there. Now I'm going to do some lips. I do a little indent there, then go over and around, then go down over and round, and then we're going to do a lip going down and up, and then a bottom lip like that. Now we'll do a cheekbone going down, around, back up and over to there. And then do a little heart shape on that one cheek. Now curve a line going down there and down like that. And I'm going to curve a line round around and then we're going to do another line going around there like that and around like that and then pull that up and over up and over and then put a couple of ears on either side now we've got that I'm going to do sort of vague v, v sort of sharp like, shape like that and then put a couple of little sort of circly bits like a sort of squashed sort of heart shape like that now you've got that you want to bring the line going round slightly wavy and out round slightly wavy and out and then again put slightly distance it from the other one to make those bunches do another one like that and then you can fill in some other lines then just to make those hair texture marks just following the shapes you've already got and then you can do the back of that head there and the back of the head round like that and then put some hair marks on there and once you've got that put a couple of little sort of marks on the face crease on the chin slap it on the eyebrow and there and that gives you the face right now next up i'm going to do a little hand over this way so as i quite often do in these sort of bean sort of shapes to make these fingers going across I'm going behind the hair there, another one like that, and then we're going to do sort of a thumb going like that, and then a crease because she wears a bit of gloves, just going like that. 
Now over this side, I'm going to do a line going down and a following along side and then a little piece on the bottom. And then that's going to go up behind her head and just work out vaguely where that line's going to go. Over to there and we're going to make that the end of a bat. And that's going to come back down that way. Put some marks on there. Now I'm going to do a line going like that and a little cuff on a glove. Now I'm going to do two lines going down for a neck and then curve that out. And then I'm going to go out and in like that and out down and in like this and then we're going to do an arm going down like that now do this arm going down there and up and the vague sign of it there and then another shoulder just over there now put a couple of creases on there underneath of the top and then do these lines going out like that and then curve around like that and a slight crease curve around a slight crease like that and then curve down to there and then up and over like that. Put a few little circles and marks on that bit just to make those shorts appear. Put a little dot for the belly button. And we'll put a vague faint line. I'm going to put the patterns on in colour I think afterwards but put some lines on there for the patterns anyway. And then I'm just going to bring that up slightly so you can see it. Now, I'm going to do another line going over and then down and around and down like that. Then we're going to do a knee and over and then curve a line around like that. And then curve that one around like that. Then we're going to do the top of these boots, so do a line going round, and then another one on that side. And then we're going to do a couple of lace marks going down like this, and the same on that side. And then curve down and out. And then we're going to do a shoe going like this, and over and up. Same there, and over, and then go down, and two lines just to make the shoe. And then we're going to do some soles on that boot going up and over, and the same there. Now I'll do a hint of that arm going behind. And we do just a hint of the hand just behind there as well. And that's just a case of a few lines here and there. Maybe do a few scratches. Which has become beaten up. And just a few lines just to kind of finish it off. And what I've also left out there, I've noticed his finger now, so you can do some little lines, little sort of squares on there for the fingernails and maybe even a hint on that thumb and just put a couple of lines behind and basically there you have a Harley Quinn cartoon <laughs>